Hello my loves, welcome back. I'm Julia and today we're going to move through a heart opening, fun, easy flow. All you'll need is at the very end of class a rolled up blanket or pillow to help open your heart even more. So we'll begin today in a nice closed leg child's pose. If this feels a little bit tight, if it's first thing in the morning, feel free to open up your knees right away. Releasing forehead to mat and breathing deeply here. Nice deep breaths into your belly. Two more breaths, nice breath in, belly expands. Exhale, belly draws in. Waking up the hips. Last one, nice and big. Next inhale, grow longer through those arms, up onto fingertips. Walk them over to the left side and release forehead, coming into that left hip flexor. Inhale, back up onto fingertips. They float over to the right and release, coming into that right hip flexor. up through center, knees widen, final few moments here in a nice wide leg child. Giving yourself a little bit of love for just being you today. Next inhale, let's look forward, coming up to our toes, a little toe sit stretching out all those bones. I love this. Actually, I'll face you guys a little bit more. Inhale, right arm to sky, up and over. Really press down through those right toes and that will give you a nice stretch in the right side body. And back up through center, left arm comes up and over, pressing down through the left toes. Growing longer through that left side. Next inhale, coming back up. I'm gonna turn again. Coming all the way up onto the knees. Nice big stretch here, tiny little back bend. And down, bum to heels. Let's inhale, heart opens, elbows are bent. Arms extend, heart opens further, throat open. Exhale, fingertips travel forward towards one another, chin to chest. Inhale, heart opens, elbows back, gaze up, arms extend, exhale forward. Moving through a few more rounds of this in your own time. There's a plane, so we're going to keep moving until the plane is gone so you can hear me. cat-cow in a seated position, waking up that spine, opening the heart. I love this one. All right, final one, you guys. Let's inhale, heart opens. Exhale, forward. And this time, let's reach those fingertips forward, coming to all fours. Hands are under the shoulders, wrists are under the shoulders, knees are under the hips. We're going to extend opposite arm and leg, so right arm, left leg, waking up the core a little bit. Nice and even here, hips are square, reaching longer through the toes and longer through the fingertips. And if you can, try to isolate and activate that left glute. A little bit longer, growing and release all fours. Inhale, nice exhale through the mouth. Inhale, left arm forward, right toes drop, right toes grow back. Again, growing evenly through the 
those left fingertips and the right toes. And that keeps you in balance. Hips are square. And try to isolate that right glute this time. Final inhale, growing even longer. Exhale, all fours, right away. Let's inhale, right arm to sky, twist. That should feel really good. Exhale, down to the mat. Inhale, left arm to sky, twist. Exhale, back to all fours. Let's tuck the toes, hips to sky, wide-legged down dog. So let's keep our feet as wide as the mat for now. Nice bend in those knees, fingers are spread, and release the head and the neck. Maybe walking it out a little bit, bending one knee and then the other. Moving in whatever way feels good for you in this moment. And feel free to pause me, but if you're ready, let's walk those feet in about hip width apart and draw the heels as close to the earth as we can. Hips tilt to sky. Feel free to keep a nice bend in the knees. Neck is released. And we're going to shift weight onto the right heel. Left knee bend. You'll really feel that through the right hamstring. Whew. Holding here for five. Remember to breathe deeply. I'm really feeling it. Two more breaths. Last one, nice breath in. See if that heel can come nice and flat. And exhale through the mouth. Let's switch. So coming onto the left foot, right knee bends, left heel draws down to the earth as close as it can get. No worries, wherever it is, is the perfect spot for you today. And again, nice deep breaths. Feel free to close your eyes. I love closing my eyes when I'm feeling some discomfort or intensity. All right, last breath in. Big exhale through the mouth. Right leg meets the left. Coming into a nice, stable down dog. Let's inhale together, plank. Exhale, knees touch down. Elbows draw in, we're lowering slow for five, all the way down. Four, moving through thick honey. <laughs> Three, your arms might be shaking. Two, and one, release. Press those toes into the earth. Let's inhale, heart peels up and forward. Nice little cobra here. And release, exhale. Inhale, push up through all fours, tuck the toes, exhale, down dog. Beautiful, let's inhale right away. Right toes lift, three-legged, and we tap. Hips are square, let's not worry too much about height at all. Inhale, lift, nice and easy. Pretty effortless here, and lift. And tap, this time right foot flexes, and we switch. Inhale, left toes lift, and tap. Your leg should feel as light as a feather. And tap, inhale, grow. Exhale, tap. Beautiful. Let's inhale, right leg to sky. Exhale, knee to nose, see if we can touch. Right foot plants, left foot plants down, arms up, warrior one. Growing taller, gaze to sky, and exhale, palms to earth, plank, knees down, child's pose. Inhale, all fours, tuck toes, plank, Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, cobra or up dog. Exhale, down 
dog. Moving on to the other side. Big exhale together. Inhale, left leg to sky. Exhale, knee to nose. Foot plants. Back foot plants. Inhale, arms up, warrior one. Growing taller and lighter. Nice inhale, grow. Exhale, hands plant. Plank, knees touch. Child, one breath here. Nice big inhale. Exhale. Inhale, all fours. Up to plank. Exhale, chatter under our cobra. Elbows in. Up dog. Exhale, down dog. Beautiful work, you guys. So we're gonna start adding on to that, adding on a little bit each time. We'll do a nice breath guided flow. So if you're ready, come with me. Inhale, right leg lifts. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, warrior one. Exhale, open, warrior two. Holding here, nice breath in, getting deeper in that front knee. And out. Inhale, reverse warrior, front arm to sky, up and over. Nice bend in that front knee. Exhale, warrior two. Inhale, high plank. Exhale, plank through chaturanga, inhale, up dog, exhale, down dog, inhale, left leg lifts, exhale, knee to nose, inhale, warrior one, exhale, warrior two, body open. Nice deep bend in that front knee. Feel free to walk it forward if you need. Growing taller through the torso. Arms are lengthening evenly. Inhale, growing in every direction. Top arm up and over. Reverse. Exhale, release. Toes in. Growing up. High plank. Exhale, touch down, chaturanga. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog. Right away, we're adding on. Inhale, right leg lifts. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, warrior one. Exhale. Warrior two. Inhale, reverse. Exhale, straight in front leg. Reach forward, forward, forward. Inhale, top arm opens, triangle. Holding here, very light on those fingertips. Palm is either facing forward, just resting on the front side of the leg, or very lightly supporting you on that shin. Let's inhale together, top arm up and over. Exhale, body lifts. Front arm up and over, little back bend. Let it all go. Inhale, high lunge. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog. You're doing so good, you guys. Let's inhale, left leg lifts. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, warrior one. Exhale, warrior two. Inhale, reverse. Exhale, front leg straightens, reaching forward, forward, forward. 
inhale, half arm up triangle. Holding here, as I said, nice and light on that left hand, either right in front or very lightly just for a little bit of balance. Let's breathe in together. Top arm up and over. Exhale, body guides you up. Top arm up and over, front arm up and over, reverse. Inhale, lost my balance there. Whoops. Inhale, high lunge. Exhale, chaturanga. You know what to do. I'm going to zip it. Up dog. Down dog. Coming into our very last round, let's inhale, right leg lifts. Exhale, knee to nose. In, warrior two. Warrior one, sorry. Out, warrior two. In, reverse. Out, reach forward. In triangle. Out, body lifts, reverse. Inhale, high lunge. Exhale, reaching forward, forward, forward with those fingertips coming onto the tippy toes of that back leg. And warrior three. Growing nice and long through the fingertips. Leg is growing with every second. I'm going to try not to fall into the pool. Wish me luck. Hips are square. Left hip might draw down in line with the right. And let's inhale together. Tapping down. High lunge. Moving through your vinyasa. Beautiful, very last side, you guys. Let's make this the most flowy, beautiful, graceful, best. <laughs> Inhale, left leg to sky. Exhale. In, warrior one. Out, warrior two. In, reverse. Out, extend, go forward. In triangle. Out, reverse. In, high lunge. Out, reach forward, forward, forward. I'm going to move back. My head might have been cut off. Warrior three. Holding here for five breaths. Again. Hips are square. This time the right hip might draw down to come in line with the left. Constantly growing, feeling as if someone is pulling you through those fingertips and through those toes. It's a good feeling. Final inhale, extending even longer. Exhale, tapping down. And moving through your final vinyasa of today's class. I feel really good. I don't know about you guys. <laughs> nice and warm, nice and loose. Now we're either walking up to a seat, coming up on those toes, and hopping or jumping up to a nice seat, coming into our cool down. Let's come into a nice little twist here. I'll do a diagonal situation. So either, as so, left leg is bent, left heel at the bum, right leg crosses over, inhale, left arm up, exhale, twist to the right. 
Release that gaze all the way over the right shoulder. Staying here is just perfect and amazing. Or you can come into a little Gomukhasana. Either sitting on that rolled up blanket that I mentioned or sitting on the earth. Closing your eyes, feeling that nice release in the hips. And if you are in Gomukhasana, let's also take the chance to twist here too. So left arm up and release to the right. Wherever you are, switching sides. This time, the right leg bends first. Left leg crosses over top, heel to the earth. Let's inhale, right arm to sky. Exhale, twist to the left, nice and gentle. And release that gaze all the way over the left shoulder. Nice deep breaths here, guys. You know what to do, either staying here in this beautiful twist or releasing for a moment, lifting your hips, coming into Gomukhasana, feeling into that nice hip release, palms on the knees for a second, closing the eyes, and then inhale, right arm up, and gentle twist to the left. This Gomukhasana twist is new, so let me know what you think about it. I may have reversed the sides of the twist when I was planning the class, but let's just go with it. Final breath here. That wind feels so nice and the sun. And release. Release the legs, untangle, windmill them out from side to side. Then we're going to come into a little forward fold to finish up, relax that nervous system. So scoot your bum back, nice and tall. Your blanket may come in handy here. Just place it under your bum, kind of sitting right on the edge. I don't have one, so I can't show you, but sitting right on the edge of it. So you're on a little bit of a tilt or sitting on the mat if you have space. In your spine, let's inhale, arms to sky. Holding here for two breaths, let's inhale together, belly expands. Exhale, belly draws in. Nice breath in, growing longer. And out. Bending those elbows, coming into a final little heart opener, well, second final. And two more breaths here. Inhale, expand. Exhale. Nice inhale. Heart opens. Shoulder blades draw together. And exhale. Arms back up to sky. Little bend in those knees. Going up, 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 and over for a little release. You can gently sway your head from side to side here, little half circles, or just stay static. And if you're not feeling too much, feel free to straighten out your legs. Just make sure that you're not rounding. Make sure you're having some contact between the belly and the upper thigh to protect your back. Gently release out of that. I want you to grab your pillow or your rolled up towel. I don't have one because I'm not prepared today, but let's just pretend we're coming, going to place it around here on your mat, just north, <laughs> higher than halfway, and coming to lie down onto that pillow. It'll be, for my girls, pretty much right where your bra is sports bra that is. Who wears bras these days? No, of course some people do. Just not me. And coming here, our heart is nice and open, arms are wide, 
either releasing the legs down into a nice shavasana, option to bend the knees, heels together, coming into a nice prone butterfly. That's my favorite. And finishing here today with some nice deep breaths. I want you to completely release your belly so you're really seeing your belly grow with every breath in. Taking all the time you need. Come back to that little bit of love that you gave yourself at the beginning of the class. And just for a sec, connect with your heart. What's one thing that you love about yourself? Anything. We are all done for today, you guys. Feel free to stay here as long as you need. Give yourself a hundred more self-loves <laughs> or come on up and enjoy the rest of your beautiful day. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you next time.